Oh my gosh, hi. Um, this is my very first YouTube video and I've never done this before, um, but I wanted to because there's so many things I wanna talk about and so many things to share and it's something new um, for me and if this video is actually posted, know that it took a lot of girly balls to post it because I've probably had it on my phone sitting there forever because I was so nervous. So please don't judge, love. Anyways, so my name is Janessa. Welcome to my very brand new, super new channel. Um, it's going to be about numerous topics. It's not like a certain thing like, oh, just about toy reviews or just about my family life or just about horses or whatever. It's about everything. It's about whatever I want to share about or talk about at the time. Um, is what it's going to be about. So, hey, um, I live in a super small town in Saskatchewan. Um, grew up here, wasn't born here, but I grew up here on a small family farm with my dad and my younger sister. Um, yeah, graduated here, moved away, lived in a city, dated someone I shouldn't have dated, wasn't a good idea. That could be a topic. It will be a topic. Um, Finally got out of that, um, moved on, lived in a different city with friends and family, did really good, rebuilt myself. And that's another, like, I really needed a lot of me time, like a lot of like self healing. So I did that. Um, then I moved back to my hometown, um, to my dad's, to help him with harvest one year. And I just never left. Um, I actually, didn't leave one because my dad um, asked me to stay and help out around the farm and I found a really good job uh, back here and uh, to my current boyfriend uh, love of my life most amazing man ever I am so unbelievably grateful to have him in my life he is a godsend seriously 100% he has no idea how much how grateful I am to have him in my life and to have him love me uh, anyways him and I dated in high school on and off for a long time just we're friends after high school really close and then as soon as I moved back he found out I moved back and that's basically the story I mean that's it he wasted no time and we've been together ever since um yeah for me I'm madly in love I don't know about him I mean you never know um so he also comes from a farming family um so he completely understands what I go through during harvest. I understand what he goes through during harvest. He's also an egg mechanic, so he's extremely busy all the time. Um, and I completely understand why that is, right? And when his busy times are and why it is like that. So there's that, that's really nice. Um, uh, yeah, so live in a small town, still live here, still help my dad with harvest, um, have a full-time job. We have a beautiful home together. Um, we have two awesome animals, two dogs. I'm a huge animal lover. Um, of course, growing up on a farm, I understand there's like a reason to have cattle and pigs and sheep and all that stuff, but I also am a huge animal lover too, so it's, you know, kind of in the middle there. Um, I have two dogs. Um, my first one was not meant to be a rescue, but she ended up being a rescue, I guess, because they were actually going to kill her when she was puppy because they didn't want her. Um, so got our first dog. Her name's Lucy. Um, she is awesome, has personality of her own. And then Bowser was a rescue. Um, and he is an amazing, lovable, giant dog. He's actually not that big, but he's pretty thick and he's full of love and energy and awesomeness. Um, so that's another thing about me. I'm passionate about um, animal rescue and making sure they go back into good homes. I really don't like hearing about animal abuse or animal neglect or any of that. I don't like that. I'd rather somebody give me their animal because they can't take care of it, they don't want it anymore or something like that, than them beat it, torture it, starve it, abandon it. I just, I can't handle that. It really makes me upset. Um, so that's another thing about me. I'm a he, I also really love children. Um, I'm a big kid lover, so that's another thing, you know, any type of abuse in any kind of family ways or anything like that really upsets me. Um, and like people abandoning kids, that just upsets me too. So yeah, 
that is a little bit about me. There, I'm sure there's lots more I'll talk about. I have a million topics to talk about and I hope you subscribe to learn more and to chat with me. My channel page is definitely gonna be 100% feel free to say what you need to say and feel free to be comfortable. You know, if you wanna talk or hear about a certain topic or talk about a certain topic, let me know. We'll go over it, it doesn't matter. It's a self-love, be comfortable with whatever page. Um, I'm all each to their own, so welcome. And I hope you subscribe down below and we can continue on. Thanks for watching.